Okay, so... I uh, stepped away for a second to just check something. Okay, so Union Cave, 33, Azalea Town, Slowpoke Well, Elix Forest, 34, 35... Okay. Okay, I was just, just snooping around. I'm gonna go battle these guys real quick, because I feel like it. I just feel like whooping everybody's ass. I'm not about to lose to any kid. Listen up, buddy. I can freaking walk faster than you can sit. Golding. I'm liking the level 10 trainers. That's good. That's nice. I, I like that. It's good news. Why would you do that? Why you do that? Ow. You'd think Total Dial can learn Crunch or Bite at some point. I mean, he's got a jaw. He's a freaking crocodile. I tried to rush things. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna beat up everybody over here and I'm gonna be happy about it. My Pokemon? Freshly caught. So, fishermen normally will catch Pokemon, and like, the, a job of a fisherman is to catch fish and to sell it and or eat it, so I'm wondering, are Goldene and Magikarp, like, are they like the fish consumption in the world of Pokemon, I'm wondering? Dude, what is up with that Poliwag's eyes? That, that Poliwag, holy, that dude has seen some shit. <laughs> Look at his eyes, it's freaking, that Poliwag is like coked out of its mind. He's also not blue, he's like a freaking gray. Poliwag is normally like the color of, uh, not great. Poliwag is normally like the color of Total Dial. I, I can't do anything, so. Way to knock off one HP. He's an impossibly strong bubble. I mean, I got nothing else better to do. It is two o'clock. This might be the last video of the night, or not. You know, I don't normally like to record till three. I try to like end my sessions between two and three, so it is only just now two. So it wouldn't even be like that bad if I did one more video after this. I at least want to get my second Pokemon though. And uh, start training it. Because it's still, it's got a good ways to go. I should, probably should have uh, saved these Pokemon, these fishermen, for the Pokemon I want. But it's, it's fine. I'm sure we'll battle other water trainers at some point. Everglades has been asleep for like seven turns. He was like 35 when he got put to sleep. Thank Christ. Damn, son. Like after after four moves I could see like hey, you know, he's asleep. But after like after like four and you're still sleeping, like come on, man. Two to three and then it's like, eh, it's fine. Oh no. I swear to God, if he used hypnosis. Oh, no, you didn't. Loser. And we're gonna use another scratch because I have nothing else to use. Uh, I can't use any water moves on Poliwag through Poliwrath. Um, if you use water on those Pokemon, it, it's like an HP gainer. Yee. Splash? Splish Splash, your opinion is trash. Alright, I'm gonna use a potion on... Um, actually, I'll just use a berry. Because I'm almost to, uh, 
Azalea Town, which I think I originally called Olive Vine or something like that, and that is not the correct freaking. That is not the correct city name. Olive Vine? I have no idea what where Olive Vine even is. Like, is that? Oh, you know what? Olive Vine is the one up there by the dock, uh, just past uh, Ecrotech or Ecuter or whatever. Whoa, you made me lose that fish. Well, you should have reeled it in faster, bud. Wow. Do you have a bunch of Magikarp? Holy crap. Wow. So this is going to be like... Let's let's see how much XP we get from all four of these. I'm going to guess 40. 40 from all... It's 10. It's going to be 10 per... Oh no, it's 21. That's, that's actually not a bad bit. He's gonna have three Magikarp and a Goldeen, probably. Ah, oh, the Magikarp actually flopped and frickin' tail smacked me. How dare he? Holy crap, this magic card's level 15, excuse me? This thing is gonna be like 48 XP. <laughs> excuse me. Splish splash Splashing in the city Can this dude like just frickin' faint? I'm gonna end up using all my scratches on freaking these Pokemon. Wow, a whole 63 for level 15. And he's gone. What was that? Like, 140? Oh, well, I said 40 initially, so I was only 100 off. Sploosh. Oh, did he fall into the frickin' river because I whooped his ass? Alright. Onward to Azalea Town, because I just whipped everybody's ass. What's up, dude? How would you like to have this? Tasty, nutritious, slow poke tail. For you right now, just a... Th just... What the fuck? A million dollars? No! What the fuck? What in God's name? Frickin' a million dollars for a slowpoke tail. Is it a slowpoke tail? Like, isn't that like, kind of like, like partially Pokemon cannibal? Well, actually, I did just have a conversation about, I did just bring up the fact that, um, about fishermen and like, what Goldeen and Magikarp might be in the Pokemon world, and they might be like the fish industry. Why would you eat a slowpoke tail? Like, what? Doesn't that get eaten by a freaking, like, shelter at some point? When a shelter. When you get a shelter to bite a slowpoke tail, doesn't it uh, evolve into slow bro at that point? Oh, God. That badge, it's from Violet City. You beat Faulkner? Yeah? What, did you beat him too? Oh, he's a bird trainer. Maybe he was an admirer. Pidgey. Level 6, really? Oh, that's right. I was like, wait, how much scratches do I have left? I have a full set because I just went to a Poke Center. Spiro. Ow. 
We're gonna chain it up a bit. We're gonna use water gun on you. And he's done. I know what my weaknesses are. Uh, good for you, man. What's this? Union, Union cave ahead. Oh, boy. I have to go through a cave? Man. I wonder if I should, uh... I wonder if I should use that repel I have. Yeah, we'll use it. Because I really don't feel like battling. Welcome to Union Cave. Thanks, man. If I could just battle Pokemon trainers, that'd be great. Whoa, what a surprise. I didn't expect to see anyone here. There's literally somebody, like, to the right a little ways. Damn, you about the same size as the fisherman dudes. I thought about getting an Onyx, and then I realized he's just not as powerful as I thought he would be. Slightly sad, because Onyx is a pretty good Pokemon. I think it's just the size. I think, I think, I think most people probably would think Onyx is great because of his size, but overall, he's kind of bad. Uh, Steelix, I think, is not that much better, but, you know, it's definitely an upgrade of some way, in some way. Yay! Thanks, man. Whoa, I'm beating big time. Heck yeah, you were. Big time's an understatement, looking at you. Hey, man. You're headed to Azalea, aren't you? Let my Pokemon see if you are good enough to battle. Does Azalea have a gym? Yes. It's a poison type gym, if I remember. Because Whitney's a grass. Or, no, no, Whitney's a normal, actually, I think. Hi, Joe, dude. Level 4. Get that shit out of here. You freaking insult me. You come to me on the day of my Pokemon Crystal Let's Play, and you insult me with a level 40 Geodude? We are so far past Violet City, my dude. Your next Pokemon better be good. I just realized, where are Geodude's eyes? He has, like, no... Oh, you know what? I think I see them. I think they're, like, really honed in on the center. Uh, initially, you can actually look at Geodude and see it just straight white, but I'm, I'm pretty sure, like... He's kind of, like, looking cross-eyed on his nose a little bit. I think that's where his eyes are actually are at. It just, initially, it didn't look like he had any. Level 8 Geodude, that wasn't too bad. Can you, like, give me an Onyx? Because that'd be great. Or not. Or a level 6 Geodude. What is wrong with some of these people? Like, what the heck? Oh ho ho! Thanks, man. Is there another trainer? Oh yeah, yeah there is, cool. Zubat Supersonic keeps confusing my Pokemon. I'm seriously upset about that. Well... Zubat can be a little bit of a prick. I understand. Ooh, a fire breather. Who sends out a cop at it? It's not really a fire breather. What's your next Pokemon gonna be? Oh wow. I'm almost level 18. I'm gonna be level 20 by the time I get to level Zaya. Or level Zaya. <laughs> I'm gonna be level 20 by the time I freaking face the second gym later, probably. Which is great, 
Uh, I think I think that's a I think that's like a decent number. Uh, ten levels per gym. So by the time I get to the seventh gym leader, like freaking total dial or Everglades is gonna be like level seventy maybe. I don't know. I don't think that's how it works, but. Hopefully he's like level 50 by the time we get to like the 6th of gym leader. I flamed out. Flame on! Oh, Everglades is evolving! Hell yeah! Let's go! I could hit B and be a jackass, but I won't. Heck yeah, let's go. Crocodile. Crocodile. Alright, so we can go to the left. What's over here? Brian found potion. Chilling. What are you doing? I roam far and wide and search Pokemon. Are you looking for Pokemon too? Then you're my collecting rival. Actually, I just realized, I think Union Cave... <clears throat> Union Cave, I think. Uh, I think there's an exit somewhere. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I think I want to find that exit rather than explore. What? Why? Scratch, scratch, scratch. Ow. Ugh, my poor Pokemon. The repel's probably gonna run out soon, so I should probably just find the exit. I think it's over there to the right, actually. Now, if I wanted to go down that ladder, I think the, the cave gets dark, so I, I can't do anything about that. If it's light, a cave isn't scary. If you're strong, Pokemon aren't scary. I am strong, thank you. Well, there's my fire Pokemon. Hello, Vulpix. New Pokemon discovered. Fire Pokemon. Actually, no, wait, no. It, this is not my fire Pokemon. This is, I was originally gonna get Vulpix, but then I remembered I'm gonna get a different fire Pokemon. I got Vulpix in, in uh, Emerald, so I'm getting a different one this time around. Excuse me. Flash. Flash thunder. Oh. Nice. Route 33. Cool. 